Hello, everybody. Tim Fall Hat Lady here. Um, I'm here with a special guest. We're going to oh, squeeze oh, into oh. frame here. This is Henry Wolf, and I don't. Hello, hello, yeah. hello, hello. <laughs> He's, he's my special mentor, and um, he's responsible for Tinfoil Hat Lady. Oh, yes, you are. He, of course I am, but he edited down all my blather into 27 minutes of sheer comedic educational brilliance, so we have to thank him. It was him brilliant. Yes. It is brilliant. Thank you. And he, he thought up the word subversive, because I was going to call it secret, and he said, no, darling, I think you should call it subversive, and you were yeah. correct. Is that right, do you think? Yeah. And he, Henry is actually a writer as well, and... Um, <laughs> He's written something that is reflective of his experience in the world. And it, it's, it's, it's a book that's going to be available for Christmas 2017. <laughs> well, it'll be out next month, actually. Oh, next in month. In England. But I thought it didn't have enough content for Canada. But then I've just been reading bits about the university oh. where I met you, Beata. Yes, you did. I did. Back in the university yeah. days. I just read a little. Okay. You know what I wrote? I wrote this. I wrote, Canadian students kept me young. By and large, they were bursting with physiological optimism. It didn't matter if they were failing their classes and had crashed at his car or that they had spent their student loans and their girlfriend was putting on weight. They bounced into each new day, refreshed and certain of a glorious future. It's all true. And <laughs> <laughs> you heard it here first. So... What, what, do you have any other things to say about this? No, it's just a memoir of 70 misspent... No, 80. 80. 80 nearly 90 uh, misspent years. And, this is a nearly 90-year-old man. Do you believe yeah, it? Oh, well, just about. And uh, I've had a lovely time, and a lot of it, some of the best times I've spent in Canada, and with people like Beata. You are fresh as a daisy, you see. <laughs> it's the new world. It isn't the old world. No, it's not the old and, world. And uh, the best thing I ever did was, A, get married, and B, come to Canada. <laughs> That's right. And I got to go to the UK this year for the first time, so now I can say to Henry that I've actually been there, and i got to say, I really love the UK. Oh, though. bless your I heart. I do. I mean, bless it's cold. No. We, Compared to this? Well... It's a wet cold. I mean, no. it, it's like a Van, it's like a Vancouver cold. Like, That's true, you know actually. what I'm saying? It seeps into your bones. Yeah, because we camped in May in Wiltshire, right? Come on, that's now that's in the pretty caravan. chilly. It was cold. Yeah. I was too scared to take a shower. I was no so cold. kidding. Yeah. But it was really fun. It was. Bless your heart. Really fun. Were you in a tent? We were in a caravan. We were in a like a trailer mm. um, that you popped up. But it wasn't like a tent. It had hard sides. Mm -hmm. Yes, with Robert Hulse. Hello, Rob. Rob will be watching this, so we'll just say... Uh, hello, Rob. Robert. Nice to meet you. <laughs> I've told Rob all about, Henry, about uh, your Rutland Weekend Theater. <laughs> oh, <laughs> television. <laughs> but don't blink if you see me in it. You'll miss me. Well, you know, we all did strange things back in the day. So In the days, that's what theater and television and film is for. Yes. To release the underside of life <laughs> into the overside of life. <laughs> like, for instance, I'm in Friday the 13th Part 8, Jason Takes Manhattan in the first 20 minutes, if you can catch me. In the establishing shot of the disco, did you know Come that? Come I didn't know that. <laughs> I bet there's something else you didn't know about Beata. She played the lead in a beautiful movie, and she looked beautiful in, uh, in India. Oh, Sita and Carol. Sita and Carol. Yes, it was oh. the first 35, film, 30, 35 millimeter feature film shot here in Saskatoon. Come on. And the, the second one was called Crisis, which they're going to be playing at the Broadway Theatre on the 28th of December. Are you in that too, Beata? I am not, but a lot of the crew that we trained up on Sita and Carol went to work on Crisis. Marvelous. So, but now, of course, the film tax credit has disappeared. Oh. oh boy! Oh boy! <laughs> so no more voiceover work and no oh more boy. no more movies. How to kill an industry? So that was sad, but uh, anyway, I just wanted everybody to meet Henry. There's nice Henry. Nice to meet you, guys and yeah. girls. Do you want to show the cover of oh, this? Oh, the cover let's, of the let's book. Let's look at the cover. I know it's going to be backwards, but it says Barcelona is in trouble. Yes. Henry Wolf. And uh, again, it's going to be out next month in the UK and so available for Christmas 2017 or birthdays all through 2017, right? Birthdays. Absolutely available. Birthdays. All right. So Take the, care. <laughs> thank you, everybody. Peace out. We love you. And uh, leave your comments below.